everybody! Welcome to Cooking with Love. This week is Scandinavian week. My parents-in-law are visiting all the way from Norway. <laughs> and I'm terribly excited to have my mother-in-law. Her name is Bjorg. Welcome. Thank you. And the great thing about uh, uh, having her over is she gets to share her recipes with us. So today we'll be making fodakul. Um, it's a national Norwegian dish and it's basically lamb chops with cabbage. So she's going to show us how it's done. Um, sh she has already prepared all the ingredients that we'll be using and I'm a huge believer of living your life um, with simplicity and elegance and certainly this dish reflects that in that Bjorg is basically using lamb chop meats um, and uh, cabbage that's been cut up nicely and it will be served with uh, potatoes and the only thing that you put into the pot is lamb, cabbage and salt and pepper. <laughs> So she has already put the first layer of lamb chops on there. Now she's going to salt and pepper it. Salt it generously. And uh, she recommends you, you have a choice between peppercorn, whole peppercorns or ground uh, peppers. It's really up to you. And then she's just going to add on a layer of cabbage. It's kind of like building a lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> this is Norwegian lasagna. <laughs> I never heard about Norwegian lasagna. <laughs> I never did either, but today we get to taste it. <laughs> and the great thing about Scandinavian cooking is it's so simple. Fresh ingredients, you know, simplicity in preparing it. And all you need is wonderful family members and and perhaps a nice bottle of wine and you're good to go and salt and pepper it again we want to make sure that all pieces of lamb gets a lots of love <laughs> it was salt and pepper <laughs> it looks quite lovely as she's doing it and now the next layer of cabbage Bjorg is preparing Ben, my husband's portion, right here. I don't know if he's going to share any of it with us. <laughs> we'll probably have to beg and plead, but... And then she's going to put in a quart of water. Not filled up, mm -hmm. just to... And then you cook it for... One and a half hour. Mm -hmm. So do you need to bring it up to a boil first and then just let it simmer? Yeah. yeah? To boil, not to not to have it percolating no. with a lot of, but you just want to kind of simmer yes. it for an hour and a half. Says the expert here. So that's what we're gonna do. How simple is this? And when it is uh, boiling, mm -hmm. you sometimes have to turn it a little bit. So you do have to watch it. Yeah. Yeah. To watch it. So don't leave the pot. Gotta cook it with love. So hour and a half. <laughs> For the side dish that we're going to serve along with for the court, um, we have peeled um, and halved about uh, six or seven potatoes here. And basically we're just going to cover it uh, up with water and boil it for about 30 minutes before um, the main entree is done. And you'll have a wonderful meal and a fantastic side dish. Extremely simple but delicious. What about the salt? <laughs> Thank you, Benabu. <laughs> so our Indian chef here always reminding me of missing ingredients that I have forgotten. But of course, as we were cooking, the <laughs> can't stop laughing. <laughs> the missing ingredient for today happens to be salt for the potatoes. So um, as I said, we'll be boiling these potatoes in a pot of water and uh, please feel free to salt it. Um, and when it's done, you'll get to have a wonderful lamb main dish along with these fantastic simple potatoes. <laughs>
。ベニブ、ベニブ、ベニブ。Oh my goodness. No, we're not going to use that. <laughs> The moment that we have all been waiting for. Time to taste the furikul, the national dish of Norway. Basically, lamb chops and cabbage. Can you see it? Mmm. 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 Piece of the cabbage. Mmm. Kind of melts in your mouth. The meat is falling apart. I can taste the cabbage. Wow, it's not gamey at all. And then with the potato. Like it? Very good. <laughs> Very good. Please try it at home. Bye bye. <laughs>